What's up, everybody? It's the Mask Lantern. Welcome back to Spyro the Dragon. We were there already. Spyro, what the hell happened? Spyro the Dragon. All right, so let us. No, God. Legend has it that there is a portal to Zephyr here, and legend also has it that I know how to activate it. Really? Furthermore, as I recall, the legend mentioned something about me activating it for uh, a small fee. A small fee. What is your small fee? Four hundred. Oh, thank you. Okay, you can come back and learn later. But if you had any idea how much treasure there is in Zephyr, you'd pay double what I'm asking. Right, yes, because, you know... To a certain extent. Um, is it fair that we have to, you know, pay money to just continue the level? Absolutely not. But at the same time, you know, at least we do get something out of it. Mr. Krabs would just rip us off com rip us off completely. Like you like I mean, think about it for a minute. The episode of SpongeBob where he had the yard sale and was like uh, he told the first dude that came over to the, his shop, uh, his uh, yard sale, and he was offering, he wanted like a hundred bucks or something for a umbrella, and he claimed that a queen used it. All right, no. See, that's just a blatant lie. And Mr. Krabs would just rip us off. At least money bags gives us something that we need. Anyways, let's see where we're going now. Ow. Spyro, the ice wizards have imprisoned our leader, Shaman Tuck. Can you help us rescue him? It is urgent. He has our tickets to tonight's hockey game in Colossus Valley. <laughs> All right, there we go. If you get on the catapult, we'll help you across the chasm. All right. Anyway, so we are here now to play this level. This is a fun level, in my opinion, because it's kind of like the opposite of the fire level we were just at. Because it's like, you know, this is all about ice, and the last place was all about fire, obviously. And I like that, because it's like, they're basically, they just kind of reuse the same characters, but in a different scenario. And, which is kind of something I like, and I think it's funny. Did he just freeze you again? God damn it, he froze you again. That's the thing about those wizard thing guys. If you don't kill them, they will refreeze them. So it kind of is a tedious type thing where you're constantly trying to unfreeze them while they are constantly freezing them. So you got to kill them first before you try to unfreeze anyone. Uh, yep. All right, so hang on a second. Oh, God damn it. You're right there. Man. All right, there we go. Where the hell is everyone going? Or are they all just un? Are they all supposed to just be unfrozen? Oh. Watch. We'll help you climb this wall up ahead. Oh, I know. I had to talk to them, and then they now they're doing. Okay. Where is it? There you are, buddy. All right. Boom. I like how they and I like that that they're using them for uh, certain things. And this is the one of those levels where you really you really don't need your uh, headbutt all that. And can I save this? Nope, I didn't save it. Didn't save it. All right. Oh god, this is this will be an interesting thing. Come on, go. No, I don't need to talk to you right now. I need to go back up. Oh god, money bags. Nope. Oh. That actually killed them, too. All right, cool. Uh, hang on. 
There we go. I don't know where I am now because I'm a little off. Oh, fuck! Not gonna save it. Nope. And dead. Damn it. Killed by Kool Aid. Oh, don't tell me that doesn't look like Kool Aid. Alright, die. Jump. Kill. Alright, here we go. We're back. So, hold on. So, this time I'm just gonna do. Alright, there we go. There we go. Alright, now I know where I am. Now I know. Now we're good. Everything's all good. Everything's hunky dory. Everything is good. But, I find it very funny that we're playing this level one day before Christmas Eve. And I'm excited because Christmas is a good time. It's, well, you can look at it two ways, uh, in my opinion. You can look at it as it's a good day for family and friends to be together and all that stuff. Or you can look at it as a holiday where let's buy everything and anything. I kind of look at it both ways. I like being with family and friends and... Same time, people just go crazy. Like, oh, what are you gonna say, my Hello friends? there, Spyro. I could arrange for you to cross this bridge for <clears throat> a small fee. Of what? Oh, okay, that is actually a small fee. Thank you, Spyro. Now I can buy that condo in Huracoast that I've been wanting for so long. Go ahead across the bridge. That actually was a fairly small, what the hell? That was a little freaky, I'm not gonna lie. Oh god. Oh god. It's gonna take. That's the thing about money bags. Uh, he'll take, like, you'll have, like, a ton of money. At least you think so. And then the prices he'll make you pay, you're just like, well, I'm back to broke. Just basically because money bags would just nickel and dime you for everything. But, anyways, Christmas time. So I'm excited. And it's Christmas time. God damn it. I'm not trying to do that challenge. I'm trying to go back up there. Thank you. Alright, so, but let's focus on this level. Because there's a little more about this level that what, than what meets the wall twice. Alright, lovely. Okay. Go, 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 go. Oh, that's right. I can't. I headbutt you. I have to, I have to use fire. A little annoying, I'm not gonna lie. There we go. Alright, easy. Alright, good, good, good. Ah, uh, but. Oh man. Oh god! Probably. I'm trying to think of what else is gonna. Yes. Um. Because there is a little more that I want to say, but I can't really say it yet. Unfortunately. I do need. Well, I will say this. There will be a video. There will be two videos coming out hopefully very soon. One will be my my view on the movie uh, Krampus, and the other will be an update video of what has ha what it will be happening in 2016. Thanks, Spyro. Just hold tight for a second and look out below. What are they doing? They got mad ups. Oh god! Oh god, where am I? That bounced and didn't break? Ow! You think those guys could have got me out of here without rolling a two-ton snowball onto my head? Here, take this crystal. I traded some hockey tickets for it. Oh! Oh no! Oh, he traded the tickets, the reason that they wanted to save him for that. Oh, God. I always thought that was funny when he said that, because I'm just, I was just wondering, I just really wish I could have known what the conversation afterwards would have been like, in all honesty. Just, all right, we got you, boss. Now what do we got to do? Now, no, it's like, now we can go to the game. What game? You know, the hockey game. You have our tickets for the game. He'd be like, oh... Those were important. They're like, what are you talking about? I so nope. They do look at me though. Um, he's like, yeah, I sold them. You did what? I'm just like picturing like something like that, and I don't know why that's just funny to me. All right, all right, we can leave this level. Yay! We didn't do it. This was a pretty straightforward level, so we're out. 
Ow. Ow. Why can't we leave? <sighs> so sensitive. <laughs> oh, you live with idiots. Oh, wow. All right. So, we will end this video here. So, thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, share, do all that stuff. And like always, I will see you in the next video. Have a good one, guys. Bye-bye!